Hi guys, my name is Jeff Rojas, and I'm a professional portrait and fashion photographer based in New York City. Those of you that are interested in breaking into the fashion industry, it can be very intimidating, especially because a lot of you aren't working with a ton of gear. And the truth is, you don't need a ton of gear in order to create fashion style images. Today I'm going to shoot three different styles of images using very limited gear. I'm going to give you guys three different lighting setups that I use as a fashion photographer. These are very simple lighting setups that you can replicate at home. I've confined myself into a very small environment, 12 feet by 15 feet. Now those of you that live in New York City, that sounds like a ton of room, but we all know that we can easily shoot this in our living rooms, bedrooms, and small little tiny areas. I know I wanted to create a very beautiful, soft form of light. To do that, our main light, our para, is positioned away from our subject. It's a very soft form of light. It's a very large form of light that's gonna go ahead and enhance our subject's jawline and soften the light. And our background light is a beauty dish that's gonna go ahead and soften the light. It's gonna create a very beautiful, soft, even glowy background. So it's gonna separate the subject from the background and create a very beautiful hiking image. I love using the Feltix Power Reflector. It's one of my favorite sources of light because it's extremely soft, it's really large, and has really contrasty edges. It allows me to have very soft, glowy skin and still retain natural edges on the face. I wanted to create a really dramatic portrait, something that we can use in a fashion editorial. Using the Studio Light Reflector on our subject isn't something you normally do with an average portrait client. Because we're working with fashion models, we can get away with using harsh light. So in order to make sure that it filled in some of the shadows that we had, we used a beauty dish with a diffuser and this creates a really dramatic portrait and directs all the attention to her clothing, her hair, and wonderful features. For this specific image, I wanted something that was really dramatic. I decided to use a combination of three different lights. I'm using our main light, which is a beauty dish, in order to accentuate my subject's cheekbones and jawline in a very beautiful way using a reflector to fill in some of the shadows, and using two rim lights in order to separate our subject from the background. For those of you interested in breaking into fashion, you don't need a ton of lighting gear to make that happen. Now, the images that we shot today are very beautiful and can be used in a variety of different sets. You can use them for editorials, you can use them for model test shoots, or if you're just trying to break into a field or try something new. Either way, you don't need a ton of gear to make that happen. 